well met everyone, Captain Deadeye is back with you with more Baldur's Gate 3 and our Paladin playthrough. Hope everyone is doing well today. Thank you so much for clicking on the video and spending a few moments of your day with me. Uh, we are over in the uh, Druid um, Enclave and we just talked to the healer. We're going to actually head out now and uh, continue questing, continue uh, through the uh, forest zone. Okay. Um, so I have been playing on my Sorcerer a lot lately. I've been trying to uh, kind of get ahead of where we are with the Paladin, so I sort of know what to expect. But at the same time, um, you know, it's, it's still going to be new and different because it's a different playthrough. So um, I sort of know where to go and kind of how the zone's laid out now a little more, a little better than I did before. So that's always good. All right, I don't think we have anything else to do here. I want to check my inventory really quick. I've been playing on my Switch, on my Steam Deck a lot, so... I have to double check and see what, what, what all we have going on here. Um, Skull of Burning Hands. Protection of Good and Evil. Okay. Dark time. I'm getting dark. Isn't that how mom usually is? Let's see. Have we already turned everything in here? I think we have. All right, so we find Carlac. Yeah, I think we can. I think we can head out of here. We did this. Get help from the healer Nettie. Nettie tried to poison us. Rescue the Duard Halson from the Goblin Camp. Okay, that Goblin Camp is extremely hard, by the way. In the conflict, defeat the goblins. Yeah, that's hard. I know most of these. Okay. All right, so let's go do. Let's go find, see if we can find Carlac. I know where she is, and she's a barbarian, which is awesome. Because on my sorcerer playthrough, I'm actually she's one of my. She's my main tank now. I like her better than uh, Lazriel. Lazriel, Lazriel, um. The, the Gith Yankee. She's just annoying, sweet. You know what? That is not the easiest of questions for me to answer. You mean just waiting? Like a lovesick puppy? Short term amusements are much less happy. Goblin tracks. Oh. One other thing I want to do that I have we did not do is let's shoot back down here really quick. And I know where our shovel is, so we can, we need to go get our shovel. Actually, I don't... Can I go? Uh, wrong one. I meant to go to this one. Sorry. There we go. Yeah, there's a shovel over here. We can we can dig up buried treasure. It's actually in here. It's right there. And there's two treasures right here next to this... Uh, Next to these ruins, we can pick up. Fish I've ever had. I don't care for fish. Red meat. Now, that's a different. Okay, open spell bark, learn new spells. Okay. What's that? Is that an arrow? Yeah. Keep your distance, darling. So I found out also that uh, Rogue is much better at uh, close range than long range. Um, that's definitely a given. So we're going to start doing that. Let's see. Oh, here we go. Here's how you learn. So, okay. Common. All right. What now? 
So if I give it to Gale, Quite ready for you. and I go to here, Lauren Spell, 50 gold, okay. So I thought it was 25 gold. Maybe that's a sorcerer thing. I don't want to spend 50 gold on that. Let's get going. Don't waste this I have 985 gold right now. I have over 3,000 on my um, sorcerer. Okay, I know where I want to go here. Let's um, let's just run it. We can go back to, up this way. Broken. Must have been here a while. Oh, there's a shovel right there, too. I walked right by that one. Oh, what's up here? I have not been up here on any character yet. Why can't I get there? Okay. Looks like I can go that way. How do I get up there? Hmm. Can I jump up here? Or is that too far? Let's try it. Where's jump? Can't. That is one hell of a vertical jump. I have not explored this area on either character, so let's go up here and see what's up here. I'm curious. Oh. My, my, what manner of place is this? A path to redemption? Or a road to damnation? Hard to say, for your journey is just beginning. Yeah, what? What would suit the occasion? Hmm. The words to a lullaby, perhaps. The mouse smiled brightly. It outfoxed the cat. Then down came the claw. And that? Love. Was that? <laughs> they do know how to write them in Cormir, don't they? Well met, I am Raphael. Very much at your service. Charmed, I'm sure, in more ways than one. Well, man, I'm Gagron. We should have a chat, you and I, but not here. This quaint little scene is decidedly too is this guy a bard? nowhere Could be. for my tastes. Come. Okay. Just not expecting that. There, middle of somewhere. Uh, can you be more specific than somewhere? The house of hope, where the tired come to rest and the famished come to feed lavishly. Go on, partake. Enjoy your supper. After all, it might just be your last. Getting tired Fair of your games. Enough. I had a feeling that was coming. Lots of demons. What's better 
than a devil you don't know? <laughs> a devil you do. Am I a friend? Potentially. An adversary? Conceivably. But a savior? That's for certain. Yep, as a paladin, I think, um... Easy, easy. Just draw my weapon. <laughs> I'm here to help, not harm. Consider your predicament. One skull, two tenants, and no solution in sight. I could fix it all like that. I serve an oath, not a devil. My honor is not for sale. <laughs> Everything is for sale. And you do well to sell while your stock has value. In desperate times, the price of honor plummets. Perhaps you haven't yet realized how desperate these times are. You will. Try to cure yourself. Shop around. Beg, borrow, and steal. Exhaust every possibility until none are left. And when hope has been whittled down to the very marrow of despair, that's when you'll come knocking on my door. Yeah, I don't think so. Hope. <laughs> Such a tease. Take me back. After that, I never want to see you again. By all means, bite the hand that feeds you while you still have teeth. All those pretty little symptoms, sundering skin, dissolving guts, they haven't manifested yet, have they? One might say you're a paragon of luck. I'll be there when it runs out. Wow. Definitely did not expect that. Okay. There's a chest up here. Hammer, tongs, and... <laughs> um... Yeah, I'll take it off. I wonder what was up here because I saw this on the map is darkened on my sorcerer and I was like, why, why can't I get up there? No, I, I know I can't. Okay, back down we go. Let's see. What <laughs> heck of a jump. Ooh, I took two damage, too. I shouldn't have jumped that high. Oops. Oh, well, good to know. Road to Baldur's Gate is a long one. All right, let's go ahead and save there, just to make sure we're uh, we're good. So, I read about save scumming, and I have never heard that term before until this week, um, when it came, came to this game, and I was like, hmm, that's interesting. But, to me, I'm like, you know, it's part of the game. I'm just going to let it go because I, if I save scum, sure, why not? Oh, it's a sit down, a sit down thing. Okay, let's go this way. I want to go save um, Carlac or, or see what we're doing with Carlac next. Oh, we got to save these guys too. We got to talk to these guys. People up ahead. Something's I don't know. You're a true soul. You can't die. Please stay with us. I don't think he's conscious. C can you hear us, Ed? You, not a step closer. A strange symbol glows, marked on their flesh. 
and something within you stirs in response. Freeze and hold up your hands. What happened to your friend? Medicine. His loom's hooked deep. I might be able to help. And I'm not using the elephant. Sure, let's add a bonus. Let's add guidance. He's Perfect. hurt badly. An oil bear got him deep. If there's anything you can do, I'm watching you. The injured man locks eyes with you. A familiar squirming churns in your head. Try to block him out, hold his stare, move away, reaching for your weapon. Your minds intertwine. You see his siblings, Andrik and Brenner. New recruits. Yours to shepherd. Protect them. He... He's a true soul. Mind him. He will. He. He. Edwin. Ed. Please. He's with the absolute now. You're. You're a true soul. Edwin, our brother. He was chosen. Like you. Do you have orders for us? We were reporting to Edwin. Um, you're mistaken. I'm no true soul. True soul. Perhaps you can help me out. I'm looking for a dude named Halson. Why are you out here? You need to find the beast and Avenger Brother. What? It killed one of us. It killed Edwin. It's an enemy of the Absolute. You're right, sir. The beast must be destroyed. The cave is just ahead. It was too much for us before, but... But if you could help us, True Soul, we may stand a chance. I don't know what he means by True Soul, but... Last time they attacked me, uh, when I said I don't know what a True Soul is, so... Absolute. What did they... We'll see what happens this Strange time. Strange power resonates within the corpse. It calls to you. its host's memories go to waste. The tadpole has absorbed it all. Its experience could nourish you, strengthen you. Um, force your mind shut. You will not be influenced by the parasite. Your muscles loosen. The tadpole breaks free of its deceased host. Your mind is your own again. For now. I don't want anything to do with the tadpole. Or the mind player. I don't want to turn into a mind player, so we're not going to even worry about that. And the owlbear is not an easy boss, but we're going to go, we're going to go fight him anyways. We're going to see if they died. I may have sent them to their deaths. But I would rather them get killed by the ale bear than me kill them. Okay, I think it's this way. Yeah, I think it's over here. There they are. Oh, there he goes. Mind player oh, Ted player. Tracks. This nest must be nearby. Yep, there they go. Good, maybe they'll help me kill it. That stench. Dead owlbear prey, no doubt. This thing is not easy. There he is. Alright. Well, I just saved outside, so I think we're going to be okay. Oh, we just leveled up. Sweet. I didn't even notice. Ah, 
Sweet, we got uh, Enraging Strike. It's a Range Strike. Okay. Your attacks summon thorny vines that possibly ensnare your target. Okay. And speak with animals. Nature's Wrath. Invoke Primeval Forkers to restrain an enemy. It cannot move, misses a lot, and easy to hit. Okay. Alright, let's level up Shadow Heart. At level 4, you get a feat, which is cool. Alright, so she gets two new spells. She gets mirror image and pass without a trace. It's level two spell slots. Sterian, sweet. Oh, he gets two cantrips. As a rogue? Oh, he's an arcane trickster. No, I have an assassin on my other guy. I think it is. Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing assassin. And then... He does more damage. Melee damage. If he's an assassin. Gale. Sweet. Gain two spells. Let's see. Prepare spells. Hmm... I like shield a lot. Yeah, we'll do shield and let's do um, Scorching Ray is really good. Mirror Image is not bad either. Let's do Scorching Ray. I know, I know that's a good spell. Ice Knife's not bad either. All right, now let's save again, just to make sure we're good. All right, sweet. Oh, he has maze armor on. Nice. All right, let's go, Albeer. You feel the quake of its heavy footsteps before you see it. An owl bear. It's beaked. Face looming out of the darkness. Jeez, the thing is massive. Compared to my dwarf. Animal handling. Study the owl's behavior. Survival back away. Performance. Puff out your chest and roar. Let's do that. A little guidance. Nice. The beast shrinks back. Feathers quivering. Oh. Okay. Okay, I guess I can't loot. Let's see if I can... Nice, I got gaping wounds on him. Sweet. Nice. That was a good attack. Oh, snap. I saved. That's good. Okay. All right, Gale already has mage armor on, so we're going to do, let's see. Where is, I picked up Scorching Ray. Where is Scorching Ray? That's weird. I don't know what happened to Scorching Ray. I know it was here. I must not have prepared it for today. All right. Crap, missed. Damn, one hell of an opportunity attack. Holy cow. 
Just trying to get away from him. Alright, let's do a uh, let's do a healing work because I want to keep her up. We'll do it at level one for now. And then let's move her back here. Alright. How did I miss? Come on. I didn't use a spell slot. That's good. That really sucks. How did I miss? Yeah, come on, guys. Can we get in the fight? Let's go. She used command on him. He threw some acid. Okay. Let's get, uh, let's see if we can just kill this little guy. Nice. There, he's down. I'll move him over here. Nice. I got an opportunity attack. Seriously. And he saved against Thunder Wave. Concentrate. All right, another. Let's do a Cure Wounds at second level. Take your, your... Keep her alive. And then. What's her AC? Did, did I see that? Maybe I'll do Shield of Faith. There we go. Where do I go from here? I don't have enough movement to get to him. Um. Problem is, he's out of my range. Everything. He's almost dead. No, I don't really want him to command. I guess I'm just going to end there because I don't really... I can't get close enough to him. Alright, let's do a... Um Sneak attack. Oh, he's almost dead. Offhand attack. We got him. Sweet. Feels like I've lost something. Let's loot in. What do you have? Head of a broken spear. A spasm grips your chest. Your strength falters. An emptiness grows within you, Paladin. Something has been lost. You have broken your oath, Paladin. At the close of day, I will be waiting for you. Wait, what? We have much to discuss. Well, that's interesting. I don't...
I didn't think I broke my oath. I mean, I didn't make a choice. I, I had to kill the yellow bear, but I guess I didn't have to kill the yellow bear. Egg. These are supposed to be worth a fortune. Hmm. It's dead. We couldn't have done it without you. Thank you. I wish Edwin were here. He would have been honored to fight alongside you. What would you have of us now, sir? Absolute protect you. Sure, I don't know. But see, here's the problem. I think if as a paladin, I would have killed them, I would have had the same issue because it, it was a decision I made that basically if you... If you tell them that you're not a you're not a true soul, they attack you. But maybe if I'm, it's unprovoked, there's magic keeping this chest sealed. I can feel its aura. All right, I guess I'll do a long rest. Let's get our spell slots back. We'll get our spell slots back. We'll heal up. I know it says not to do... I've read online not to do a lot of long rests, but I figured for now it would be okay. Let's see. And actually, I kind of bothers me. Like, I, I don't like doing something that's against who I am as a paladin, so that, that kind of bothers me. We meet again. I shall be here in thy camp. I'm just going to skip this guy. I don't want to attack you. Thou hast need of my oh, here he is, right here. I have been waiting for you. I felt the moment of your liberation. The shedding of your bond. You called to me. I am here to show you the way. Who are you? I don't need your help, stranger. I can look out for myself. The way to what? I'm in no mood for riddles. Whatever you have to say, spit it out. I offer no riddles. Nor do I offer clarity. Where you must walk, there are no signposts. There are no maps. It is a path I have walked since the moment I fell. Now, you will walk it too, Oathbreaker. You swore to protect life itself. To serve the natural order, to protect those who value life, and vanquish those who would destroy it. Tell me, why did you abandon your oath? Um, it was not my intention. My acts had unexpected consequences. A lapse in judgment. To know the reason for your fall is, perhaps, to know the shape of things to come. Take comfort in your undoing. I, like you, abandoned my cause. But much can still be achieved. Your oath is broken. The light within you fades. A new power is awakening. Well, I don't like that. Isn't there a way to reclaim my oath? It is possible. But such a promise must not be made lightly. Wealth must be sacrificed and your soul re-pledged. It is wise to first consider what is gained and what is lost in the bargain. Should you wish to do so, speak with me again. I don't want this. I want to remain you pure. You refuse. But this alone will not restore what was lost. Without light to guide you, or darkness to consume, you will remain adrift. Powerless. I will find a way to reclaim my oath. Mm. Until that day, I will be here. And my offer 
will remain. Okay. Yes, yeah, so that really annoys me. sleep well, flitting between dreams and nightmares. Maybe you wake up because you know something is wrong. Or maybe you just get lucky. Shit. No, no. It's not what it looks like. I swear. I... I wasn't going to hurt you. I... I just needed... Well blood there in the dim firelight you see him for what he really is a vampire oh, i a saw it from the start to sanguine hunger how long since someone how long since you killed someone days hours i've never killed anyone well not for food i feed on animals boars deer kobolds Whatever I can get, but it's not enough. Not if I have to fight. I feel so weak. If I just had a little blood, I could think clearer, fight better. Please. A strange sensation courses through you, and your companion's mind unfolds, secrets half revealed. Why didn't you tell me? At best, I was sure you'd say no. More likely, you'd ram a stake through my ribs. No. I needed you to trust me. And you can trust me. All right. I do. I believe you. Thank you. Do you think you could trust me just a little further? I only need a taste. I swear. Hell no. No. No, of course. Silly of me to even ask. I'll go and find something on four legs to eat, I suppose. See you in the morning. You watch him stalk away, slumped, sulking, and ready to kill. Morning. I hope last night's little unpleasantness hasn't left a bad taste in your... Well, <laughs> I hope there are no bad feelings. No, but I have questions. How have... How have survived... How have survived out there in the sun? How have you survived out there in the sun? Oh, I have no idea. By rights, I should be cinders in this light, but someone or something is keeping me alive. Standing in the sun, wading through a river, wandering into homes without an invitation. They're all perfectly mundane activities now. As for my other quirks, well, <laughs> we can figure those out in time. If I can help, just ask. We're in this together. <laughs> you're such a sweetheart. I'm just glad you're being sensible about these uh, revelations. I was worried people might turn up with torches and pitchforks. Although there's still time. So we're traveling with a vampire, are we? Of course we are. Word of warning, Astarian. I taste absolutely awful. I'd just better not wake in the night to find fangs at my throat. I trust him. He won't hurt us. Oh, quite the opposite. I'm here in the spirit of openness and honesty to work together as a team. 
Maybe we could get him to wear a bell. Dissuade any nighttime prowling. There now. We're all friends again. Shall we go? There's a long day ahead of us. Alright. Yep, let's go. Well, I hate being an Oathbreaker. I don't know why. I guess killing the Elbear is what did it. I, it's the only thing I can figure because I killed him with my sorcerer and never had an issue, but I wasn't a paladin then either. But the thing is, it's like I didn't attack him. I sent him away and then he attacked me. So I don't understand. I, I don't know. Whatever. Okay. Let's, uh, let's, well, I just saved it. So, okay. We want to go up here next. That's the plan. And like I said, I'm afraid that if I had had attacked those two individuals, then um, they would have done the same thing. I would have had a bit of an oathbreaker for attacking them too. I'm not going to hurt you, buddy. Let's do perception. Let's try that. Nice. A crit. You see a name etched into the leather. Scratch. It's all right, Scratch. I'm not going to hurt you. With a deep, heartbroken whine, the dog bows his head. Come on, Scratch, follow me. He whines, but remains rooted by the corpse's side. Alright, so we got Scratch. Cool. Anything over here? Oh, maybe. There's some camp supplies. There's a berry bush. Fishing rod, bucket of fish. I'll take that. Basket. Nope. Mushrooms. Just for crafting or for uh, camp supplies. I don't know. But we'll take it anyways. All right. We found scratch. Let's go. Thought there was a way to go up here, but maybe not. May have to go through the goblin camp. I think I do. This is the goblin village. They've taken over this village. I don't want to go by the front gate because they do attack me. I want to go around the front gate. Now there is a witch in a bog over here. Strange. Um, it looks healthy. But we're not going to. Uh, we're not going to provoke her. That was a weird quest in general. It's dead. Let's go. Thought you was busy with the foul bloods in Elson's Grove. Honor demanded I extend my travels further afield. That's a fancy way of saying I had something better to do. Wish I'd had something better to do when I came across this contract. Bloody goblins ran through my crew. And all for nothing. What was the contract? The kind that leaves half your crew dead. There's a wizard in Baldur's Gate that'll pay gobloads for a relic. 
Supposedly buried round these parts. But gold ain't any use if you're too cold to spend it. Um, you're giving up? I might take a shot myself. True, I wouldn't risk it twice for... I wouldn't risk it twice the gold. Is it gold? Have at it. If you think you can do better. Now see, on my sorcerer, I calmed him down and he stayed in town. He wasn't here. Goblins jumped us. I'd give you a map of the temple and wish you a happy funeral. But my mate Brian kept hold of it like his own sodger. Goblins made sure to the fat old chunk. All I've got's the contract. Can show you where we turn back. If you feel like dying. I hear the druid leader went with you. As soon as he heard we had a contract to find that night song relic, he was more eager than a hound in heat. When the goblins jumped us, most of my crew scarpered, just like I taught them to. The old codger didn't. And you just left him to die? Yeah, and I'd do the same again. It weren't my responsibility. If you want to play the hero, go ask the goblins nicely, and maybe they'll give you whatever's left of him. Come on. We're wasting time. All right, peace. Yeah, so there's goblins up here at the gate. Um, let's go this way. There's a back way into the town to where you don't piss off the goblins. Beehive. I think it's up this way. We're going to save. Just be on the safe side. And they're right here. The last time I was able to bluff my way through the through with persuasion, but my persuasion on this character is not very good. Hello and welcome to Bogrot. Now, kindly, gives all your stuff. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Uh, let's see. Plus four from intimidation, plus four from... Oh, okay, so I have persuasion on both. Uh, it's a fine day, my friend. Why spoil it with killing? Oh my gosh, a crit fail. Come on. Killing you would make my day. But I don't fancy cleaning up your guts afterwards. End over your stuff now. All right, intimidation it is. Let's do it. There we go. Temper on you, eh? I'm fine. Keep your goods. Our crowd own this town. We can take you any time we want. Uh, I'll take all those. What are we doing on... How are we doing on uh, inventory? Let's see. Uh, wait, what I'm looking at. So we're... Well, 420. Wow. Garbage. Okay. A lot more than my Come my on, sorcerer. I'll be summing here. Absolute dump on this junk. How do you know? If I just do. <sighs> Getting drunk off that chop as he can. Ain't fair. See, they just it's funny because the goblins just kind of let you walk around and do your own thing, like it's just weird. I did not find anything in here last time. I don't think there's anything here. They pretty much looted everything already. Now, I'll tell you what I did find is back here in the back. Oh, let's... I gotta click the wishing well. Or the well. There was something in the well. 
Let's, let's check that. Apart from an overgrowth of moss, <coughs> the well looks unremarkable. Investigation. Nope. Dry stones line the wall, but the dark. All right, I'm wanting to come over here. Let's take a stair again. A crooked touch. Bonus guidance. He's excellent at opening locks. Nice. Haste Helm. At the start of combat, the wear gains momentum for three turns. Very nice. I'll put that on. <laughs> Can I hide that? Is there a way to... Yeah, show helmet. There we go. Hide helmet. Perfect. Fish. I'll take all the fish I can get, because those are camp supplies. Rotten chicken eggs. I don't want that. There's a shovel. Oh, up here. This is funny. If I can get it to work the way I did on my, my uh, sorcerer. Stop this thing! Flap those wings some more, and I'll feed you a worm. And you! Hope you got a stomach for rights! What the hells are you doing? What's it bloody look like? We're teaching this here pipsqueak to fly! Let me rephrase that. Why are you doing this? Because it makes me laugh! <laughs> Fun's over. Release the gnomes at once. You! This little cave lurking, what's it? Find your own. He's ours! As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Get advantage. Nice. Goblin's nostrils flare as if trying to judge you through smell alone. We're leaving. What about the gnome? Ain't we supposed to bring him to. I said we're leaving! There's plenty of sport and rich pickings out there for us! Okay, so that worked. Fresh meats, scared meats. I want to see. Alright, so last time. <laughs> I uh, turned the brake off and he went flying, so I don't know if that's what I want to do this time or not. I want to see if there's another way to get him down. Nice speedy bike feet, like that. When the wearer dashes or takes a similar action during combat, they gain three lightning charges. I'm going to send those to, uh, let's give those to Asteria. Another shovel. Have to keep going. That's too close. Burlap sack. 
Rotten cheese. Sandals. Rotten carrot. Okay. Yep, nothing here. Nothing else here. All right, yeah, so last time I, uh, I hit this brake, re release brake lever, and he went flying off into the distance. So this time we're going to hit brake lever. Good. Hopefully we actually saved him this time. Animal carcass, nothing there. Brazier, let's see what's in the chest. Nice. I'll take all those. Thank you. Skull lantern. Large bottle. Yeah, last time I just hit the wrong wrong button. Cabara, those pustulant thugs. Well, get on with it. Yeah, get on with what? You saved me. Now you'll extort me. That's how this works. Yes. I'd rather know how you got caught. Uh, my own fault, really. I should have dropped my pack and outrun those bastards. Alas, take my pack if you can find it. The only reason those goblins caught me was its weight. I'll travel lightly from now on. You're a little far from home from a deep gnome. Ignorance is alive and well, it seems. Deep gnomes aren't restricted to the Underdark, you know. I've lived in Baldur's Gate for years. I'm in search of a friend. I fear he's in trouble. See this? I gave it to him years ago before I left home. I found it around the neck of a thug in the lower city. It was speckled with blood. My friend, nowhere to be found. But I still have hope. I have reason to believe he's in the Underdark. Hopefully I'll pick up his trail from there. I always help my friends. On that note, <clears throat> I bid thee farewell. If we should meet again, well... We will have met again. Hmm. Okay, cool. So, yeah, last time I did not do that. I, uh, like I said, I threw him off and he went flying. A map leading to the Night Song. However, he was killed by Goblin's Temple. Night Song is some kind of temple. It must be in the Goblin camp. I know where that is. Uh, a wizard in Baldur's Gate is offering a hard sum of money to anyone who brings him Night Song. Okay. All right. We are going to save here and call it an episode because we're nearing the hour mark and I have to go to work. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I really do appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, come back next time for more Paladin action. Hopefully we'll regain our oath eventually. I don't know why we broke it to begin with. The Albear attacked me. I just defended myself, but whatever. Uh, anyways, thank you so much. Come back next time. We really do appreciate it. Until we meet again, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and we'll see you next time.